Hello YouTube, welcome back to the long drive. This is part two of the video, so if you haven't seen part one, jump back into the into our channel and have a look. Uh, this is part two, not that you really need to see part one, but we're heading along the road. Car's a little wobbly because we have one wheel that's a tad smaller than all the others. I've been driving for about five minutes or so without the video running and now I've turned it back on because I can see we're coming up to what looks like a haunted house or a garage. I'm not sure yet, but there's definitely something up ahead in the distance. Watch out for this big giant rock in the road. That won't end well if we hit that. Car definitely goes a bit faster now. It's got the larger wheels, getting over 120. I'm doing only 80 before, so it's running a bit better. Hopefully it won't take us too long to get to that place. Looks like it's a bit off the road, but that's all right. When we get a bit closer, we'll hit a turn to the right. Whoop. Looks like there's something else out that way as well, but we'll just leave that one and we'll go to this one. Which looks like it might have the best stuff. If it is one of the haunted houses, they dev generally have weapons, food, sometimes cars, definitely some paint, fuel, maybe some tyres as well. Yeah, it looks like it might be a haunted house. It's probably one of the best stops along the way. Front gates is usually the best way to enter, so we'll try and find where the front gate is. Here we are. Now there's quite often people here, so we will have to watch out. Oh, here he comes. All right. Sorry buddy, but probably not ready to be attacked at the moment. I've got to say that sword is pretty handy. Out of our way there buddy. Bumps, bump, bump. There's definitely someone else here, so I have to watch out. Here he comes. How you going? Nice to meet you. Sorry about that. Interesting. A leg. Hmm. Nice people. Okay, there's definitely someone else here. Probably going to be upstairs, I'm guessing. Let's just quickly go upstairs so we don't have any people surprising us. Hello, anyone up here? Can definitely hear him. Oh, here he is. Hey, Jebediah. Sorry about that, Jebediah. I think that might be all of them. Okay, I'm pretty sure I can hear one more person somewhere. I'll have to keep an eye out. Probably going to be out the back. That's all right. Some blue spray paint. Uh, 
Hopefully some petrol, that'll be handy. So a bit of food, not seeing any weapons yet, but that's alright. Severed hand. And a basement. Let's just quickly paint the car and then head down the basement. Interesting place to put a coffin. So not going to be quite enough paint, like usual. Chuck that away. Now let's quickly check the basement. Probably better off with our sword. Just in case. Some green spray paint. And an interesting tunnel. Some sausage, boot, flashlight, and a golden jug. Let's go. Go through the tunnel and have a look. Sometimes this thing's placed in here. No. Nah. That's right. Comes out at a gravestone or gravesite. Okay, so I think it's the first one of these places I've been to that doesn't have doesn't have a gun here. Well, that's alright, we'll fix up the car a little bit. Oh, left the headlights on. My bad. Yeah, gives you a bit more shine. That's empty already. Let's go have a quick look in the kitchen. There's usually a bit of stuff, a bit of good stuff in the kitchen. And then we'll have a quick look outside. There's also a motorbike there, which is a bit interesting. Doesn't look like there's anything under there. Nothing under there. Motorbike looks like a pretty good neck. Red spray paint. Okay, we'll whack that in the inventory. And other than that, this is probably the. Uh, there's a couple more sprays. Let's have a look. What we got? Like that in the inventory. Get the car a quick spray, and then we'll head out the back. Might as well grab that gas while we're here. And we'll head to the next stop by the looks of it. It wasn't the greatest. Let's try and finish this door off a bit. There she goes. Oops. Just quickly put our door back on. Now let's have a quick look around the back. Probably going to need our samurai sword just in case. Ok, 
Okay. Bit of a junker, that one. Bit of a mix of dodgy fuel. Not going to be much use to us. Uh, wheels and tyres on that thing don't look that great. Let's have a quick look in here. Sometimes there are guns in these things. Oh, there's a killer rabbit. Well, his eyes aren't red, so I think that means he's, he's probably okay. Nah, I think it's time to grab that petrol and get out of here. Now I remember where I saw the gas tank. What else we got near anything else? Oops. Okay, there was something explosive under there, not sure what it was. I'm looking for. Let's take this downstairs. Let's fuel her up. Shark her on there. Turn the lights off and have a sleep. Didn't take long to fall asleep. A bit easier to play in the daylight. Now let's get out of here. Okay, if we head straight ahead, we should, with these uh, unusually sized tyres, but hopefully we can fix the front right and stop the weird wobbling lane. I'm thinking about 20 minutes for each video so that it's not too long to watch. Let me know in the comments if you want something longer or something shorter. But 20 minutes generally gets you to see you know, at least a couple of stops. And I can always edit some of the boring stuff out of the middle if I have to. like another haunted house up on the left there. When we get a bit closer, we'll turn left. And maybe a little bus stop coming up up here. Sometimes there's things at the bus stop, sometimes there's not. We'll have a quick check here. It doesn't look like much, but we'll have a quick check. Oil was it? Mm, bit of oil. I guess we can check the engine. And two-stroke fuel and a moped. I guess that's a bit interesting. She might be stuck. Oh, fuel's empty. We could put fuel in it and have a go, but you know, really, we probably don't need a moped. Oh, there's a bit more gas for us. That, I? Now let's have a quick check of the oil. There, yeah, we're near enough to full. Let's go. Let's head on over to this haunted house. Our second haunted house. Not bad. Sometimes you can drive for days and not find these things. Hopefully this one might have a few more cars and it'd be nice to find a Christine. Or at least a Christine engine to put into this thing. Nice V8. Okay, 
Okay, where's the front gate of this place? That looks like the back. That's the side gate. And there's the front gate. Hopefully we didn't just... No, oh, this one's not open, so I don't think we've been here. There's no dead people here, so this mustn't have been the one we've already been to. There's our dodgy tyre. Oh, I can hear voices. Oh, here he comes. Right. He will jump in the car, so we better just take a run off before we run him over and then get out and stab him with the sword. Quickly drive in here, park the car, jump out. Grab a sword. Okay, where'd you go? Where'd you go, Elma? Oi, Elma, come over here. Elma. Ah, uh, well, he'll come back later. We're gonna see if his brothers are in here. Probably are. Knock, knock. More severed legs. They're not the nicest people around, I gotta say. Another air rifle. We just seem to be finding air rifles. Oh, hang on, there's a better gun. There we go. Now we're talking. Pretty sure we can. I'm pretty sure we can reload this thing, but for now we might just carry the sword anyway. While we check out this place. Okay. Let's check out the kitchen. Oh. Hey, Elma. Sorry, buddy. Sorry, buddy. No hard feelings, but if you're going to attack me, then you're probably going to end up getting chopped with the sword. Better keep an eye out for Elmo's brother. and a skeleton. Interesting. Hmm. I guess that was one of our last victims. A bit of nice blue paint. That'd probably be interesting. Oh, if there's a colour you like and you uh, like to see the car get painted a certain colour, just comment down below and we can uh, paint her up. Give us some red now, hopefully we don't get attacked while we're walking out with our red paint. Uh, he's still at the front there. On Clod Hopper. Yeah, we might make a bit of a rainbow. See if we collect some more paint from somewhere. Never gives you quite enough paint to paint everything. Okay. Let's have a quick look upstairs. And we oh, another bed in the way. Seems to be a bit of a thing in this game. Better be ready, there's probably gonna be someone up here. Oh here he is. Hey Jebediah. Sorry dude. Whoa! The old attack move, we got a crowbar there, it's probably handy as well. So I'm guessing that's gold, but I'm not really sure it's worth anything in the game. 
Sorry about that, Jebediah. Don't really need the crowbar while we've got the sword. Oh, another one. These guys are everywhere. Oi, AK-47. Now we're talking and a mag. Alright. Let's uh, stick that sucker in our inventory. There we go. Now I don't have enough hands at the moment, so I'll have to run downstairs and empty some stuff out. But we now have an AK-47. And I can hear either a person or a rabbit, I'm not sure which one it is. Okay, let's pop this boot up and throw these bullets in. I thought I threw these in before, but they seem to be coming back in the inventory. Let's chuck them in there. I'm not sure if I've still got the other bullets or if I've lost them. They seem to... Stuff does disappear in this game, i got to say. Let's see what else I've got in the inventory. Uh, a lot of guns. Let's see if there's a... Interesting. Didn't know that they attacked, but they yeah, seem to be a... Uh... Okay, now where do we find that magazine? Grab that, stick it in our inventory. Number two slot. Should, oops, that was a bit weird. Number two. Now, if we put on number one slot, it should hold in the number two slot nicely. We do have bullets for this gun, I think, as well. So we can always reload this. But if we can find a basket, there's baskets in the game that are designed to go in the car and they hold all your inventory so it doesn't bounce around and you don't lose it. But they're not. Not at every stop. Sometimes they're hard to come by. Probably got a few too many things in my hands. Let's just chuck this gun. Oops. Chuck him in there. Hopefully he won't disappear into the abyss. Quickly fill the car up. Oh, that wasn't good. Instead I was drinking it. Interesting. Probably not the best tasting drink around. Okay, let's hope we don't lose that stuff. Let's close the boot, bonnet, whatever you want to call that thing. Jump in the car and save the game from here. Alright, that'll be the end of this part two. If you're interested, come back for part three. Please like and subscribe if you enjoy any of our videos. And hopefully TNT Man will be back tomorrow. And it won't just be TNT Man's dad. All right, thank you. See you later.